One span sign offers a variety of robust and flexible authentication options, including support for e-signing with digital certificates. One span sign supports signing with government-issued smart cards, as well as electronic ID smart cards and tokens issued by trust service providers in Europe. In this video tutorial, we'll demonstrate how a user can configure a transaction to enable e-signing with a digital certificate. We'll also provide a detailed walkthrough of how signers can securely e-sign documents using a digital certificate. To begin, ensure the Signing with Personal Certificates option is enabled in your OneSpan Sign account. Click the New Transaction button in the top right-hand corner. Enter a title for your transaction. Click the Create button. Add your document and recipient to the transaction. Click the ellipses icon for the signer who needs to e-sign the transaction using their digital certificate. Then click Settings. In this example, Sam will e-sign the transaction using his digital certificate. Next, in the Recipient Settings dialog box, select Signing Method. In the drop-down menu, select Personal Certificate, then click Save. Sam can now e-sign the transaction using his digital certificate. Click Next. Add signature blocks to the desired locations on your document for your recipient to sign. Click the Send to Sign button to distribute your document for signing. Sam receives an email and accesses the document he needs to sign in one span sign. Next, he clicks the signature block to start the signing process and then confirms his signature on the document. Since it's Sam's first time using his digital certificate to e-sign a transaction, a dialog box appears requesting him to install a personal certificate client driver on his computer. He downloads and installs the driver so he can e-sign transactions with his digital certificate. He clicks Done. The Certificate Selection dialog box prompts Sam to select the desired digital certificate to complete the e-signing process. He clicks the Sign button of the digital certificate he'll use to e-sign the transaction. After successfully signing the document, a secure, tamper-sealed PDF with a comprehensive audit trail is embedded directly into the document showing who signed, in what order, when, where, and which certificate was used to sign the document. Visit our support center for more video tutorials about one span sign.